Are you looking for a new way to connect with your viewers? Do you wish you could turn your passion for streaming into a pastime that actually makes money? Introducing Blurp Sound Emotes, the all-encompassing solution for better viewer engagement and monetization on any streaming platform. With Sound Emotes, your viewers can play blurps to your YouTube stream, your Facebook gaming stream, or directly to your computer, creating a whole new world for interacting with your viewers. Here's everything you need to know to set up and use your own Sound Emotes page with Blurp. First, go to blurp.com slash sound emotes and sign in with your Blurp account. The very first prompt will be to add sound emotes to your OBS system. This is how Blurp communicates with your stream. If you're using OBS Studio, connection is as simple as dragging and dropping a widget into the program. You can adjust the size and location of incoming Blurps by changing the source's preview in OBS. Wow. If you're streaming with something else, copy and paste the URL, then paste it into your streaming program as a browser source to connect Blurp and activate the use of your Sound Emotes page. Be sure to customize your Blurp URL to make your Sound Emotes page easy for your subscribers to find. Then copy and paste it into all of your streaming descriptions, titles, bios, and everywhere else so your followers know where to go to support and engage with you. Now you're ready to go and set up your own Sound Emotes page where you'll notice a few new symbols. The driving force behind Sound Emotes is Beats, Blurp's very own digital currency. Beats are used to share sounds to your live stream, with other ways to utilize Beats coming soon. Once viewers trade currency for Beats, they'll be able to use those Beats to share Blurps live on your stream. Much like the Twitch extension, all Sound Emotes settings are completely customizable. To start setting up things the way you like them, click on the Settings option in the top right of the page. From here, you'll be able to configure your Sound Emotes experience. First, let's look at the two streaming modes, Simple Mode and Search Mode. In Simple Mode, only your featured and favorite soundboards will be available to your viewers. This keeps the blurps played on your stream completely under your control. Search Mode allows your viewers to search and share millions of blurps from our extensive database. You can still feature soundboards in this mode. Right underneath, you'll find Beat Amount, which is the universal control for how much it costs to play blurps on your Sound Emotes page and your stream. We recommend 10 to 15 beats for smaller streams, or upwards of 150 for much larger streams. How much it costs is totally up to you, and the best part is, anyone who uses Blurp gets 100% of the proceeds donated through Beats. We strive to keep all of Blurp's content DMCA compliant, but if you'd like to be more cautious with music, or if you'd just prefer no music be on your stream, click the option to block all shareable music on Blurp. This option is a beta, so if you ever have feedback, we'd love to hear it. At the bottom, you'll find the maturity rating setting. This controls what kind of blurps make it to your stream. All of our blurps are rated G through R, and you can set the rating to match what you want played on your stream. Now over to the soundboard side, where you can not only feature your favorite soundboards, but choose custom beat prices for each featured board. To change the beat price of a certain board, click the Edit Selected Boards option, and use the drop-down menu to customize the price. You can make your personal soundboard cost less to play, or jump scares cost more. It's all up to you and how you want to run your stream. When we say customizable, we mean customizable. Not only can you choose which boards to feature and the cost of each board, you can also choose how much each individual blurp on a board costs, and even which blurps can be seen on a specific board. Want one of the blurps on a certain board to feel like a premium blurp? Up the beat price by clicking on the soundboard and choosing the Edit Blurps option at the top. Love a particular soundboard, but don't want one of the blurps on it to be played? Hide it by clicking the eye to closed in the same menu. Whether you're in simple mode or search mode, you can still feature boards for your followers to choose from. To remove featured boards, click the Edit Selected Soundboards option and click the X on the top right corner of the board you want to remove. To add a new featured board, scroll down to Add a Soundboard and either search or choose from the drop-down menu to find the board you want to feature. To add it, click the Add icon on the top right. Under the Sharing tab, you can set the cooldown time for the entire stream, as well as set the volume for all incoming blurps. In the Blacklist section, you'll be able to block specific searches within Blurp. This gives you the ability to censor certain words from being searched, and you can block specific blurps or boards from ever being played on stream. You're all set up, connected, and ready to stream, so the last thing you need to do is learn how to share blurps. Depending on your settings, your viewers and followers will be able to view and browse your featured boards and use the search bar at the top to look for whatever blurps they want. To preview a blurp, just click the play button in the middle of it. Thank you! To actually share a selected blurp, click the share on stream option on the right side of the screen. Thank you! When a blurp is shared, a secondary option to donate beats will pop up. This is an option for your followers to donate even more revenue to you, their favorite creator. 
In fact, 100% of the beats your viewers spend on blurps go directly into your pocket, making it the perfect streaming partner to increase viewer engagement and participation while also helping you monetize your passion. And that's it. Everything you need to know about sound emotes. Sign up now at blurp.com slash sound emotes and join the Blurp Discord server to ask questions, get help, or promote your stuff with other streamers and creators.